back to my channel. In today's video, we will see how to make video from photo. For this, I am using one video editor here. Open shot video editor. Just open this open shot video editor. So, the interface will look like this. It actually looks like this. Here you need to import the file to make video. So, you can right click here. Or you can just click on this plus icon to import the file. So that where is your file? Where is your photos? Here I shall save some shared photos. So from here I'm selecting the some photos. So you can select the, all the photos, or if you want just particular photos, you can select it and click on a open. So here you will get all these photos. Now you can arrange all these photos on this track. See, here is a just uh, storage. Okay, here you will, uh, you can understand which photos are here or which audio or video files are here. And here is a track. See, here is a uh, track number 5. You can scroll down and you can check for the all the tracks. Okay, suppose I am using here track number 4 or track number 5. See, track number 5 means above layer. So, on above layer, which photos I want, select this photo here. Suppose I want this one photo, so just skip here. See, here is photo. See, here you will get your photo. See, suppose I want one more photo here, so you can select the photos from here. Suppose this is second one photo, or you can set as per your requirement. So, just I want to do second photo here, third photo here. You can select and you can adjust the duration of this photo, visibility of this photo. Then this one photo. If you want to add more photos, you can add the more photos here. Like this, just click on this, drag and drop on this track. You can select, drag and drop the photo here. Again, if you want, you can select and you can drop it. See, just click on this photo, drag it and drop here. Select this one photo, drag and drop here. Okay, so in this way you can select your photos from this and if you want uh, more file, you can just right click here, you can just click on the import file and you can again select the particular file, click here and open this file. Okay, now I have enough photos here, so I am just selecting the photos from this storage. Now, see, for these photos, suppose you want to change one background music, then you can select the music from your system and you can apply the music. Here, one audio file is here. Suppose you want new audio file. See, just click on this plus, plus icon or in this empty area, right click, click on the input file and you can input your music from your system. If it is inside the music or it is inside the particular folder, you can just click and you can open that music here. Here, already I have picked the one music, so just click on it, drag and drop here. See, this music is too long. And my photo is till this point only. So now I am going to adjust this music. Now this music is adjusted. See, like this. Now make a file. You can check for the period.
want to take one particular photo. Suppose I don't want this one photo. So you select it, click on a delete, and you can adjust your photo again. And you can check for this lens also. Okay, just click on this aim. So you will get to know here is the gap. So you can adjust this one. Again, click on the aim. So now both are equal. And then just click on this import export video. So your video will be ready. Here you can give the name for this video. So here I am giving the video name as two two six. And here this video will show inside the admin. If you want to change the location, you can just click on the video and you can here you can select the folder and you can export the video. So within some seconds, you will get your video ready to use. But if video is more than one minute or the lengthy video is there, then at that time it will take the time. Advantage of this open source video editor is it is uh, free to use. You no need to pay a uh, single rupee for uh, this. And uh, it is a watermark free software. So when you are creating the video, you will not get any type of watermark behind your video. So see, this is the progress of your video. Yes, yeah, see, 100%. Then click on it done. You can save this project for future review. So save changes to project before closing. Yes, just click on yes. And you can save this project with one name and just click on a save. And you can check for your video also. Go to the videos, see where you save in this folder. So here you can check your video. This video is ready to use. Okay, here is your video. You can check the sound and quality of this video. Thanks.